Reacton um, was a business incorporated in 1996, primarily to deal with pneumatic um, automatic fire suppression systems. Um, it's undergone a change of ownership and we're now looking to become the world leaders in automatic fire suppression systems. We're a business driven by quality and driven by the reliability of our products and unless we have a package that enables us to take a product take that product into a production environment and create working procedures and processes quickly and efficiently, we, are going to, we will suffer some serious time delays in, in the production side of the business. SolidWorks for me is, is a package that enables the entire areas of the business to streamline from product you know, inception all the way through to product support and marketing. Um, it's a total solution for our business. We need to precise, um, calculate some of the ratios that our product need to have for um, internal parts. So SolidWorks can actually um, accurately report those measurements so we can uh, um, create the product and make sure that um, from design it actually operates correctly. The major uh, problems that we are facing uh, um, uh, in our design phase is to be able to correctly and accurately um, hit our tolerances and interferences within the design, like our dynamic parts, then this very, very um, uh, tiny pre precision that you are actually asking. So SolidWorks is not only help helping us to actually design that, but it's helping us to see, to visualize the movement and being able to uh, simulate some of the strengths. Composer and Visualize are really key products um, that enable the, the non-design side of the business, the marketing, the sales side of the business to support our customers and I think that's a really important point to reiterate is, is the supporting of our customers. So if, if they have a project, it, you know, it could be a, a, a crane at a dock, it could be a wind turbine, it could be, it could be a number of different projects and in order for them to win a contract, to win a tender, they need to be in the best position to explain to the end user what it is that is a competitive advantage of our product. It's modelled, it's tested for its interference fit with the other sub-assemblies that it's going to mate with, but also it's rendered, yeah, it's used in all our marketing material, um, and it just again, it enables us to give our customers 3D, high quality pictures of what we're selling, so they know what they're buying even before they've touched and felt the product. Solid Gooks and specifically um Obviously, the designing side of it, 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 it if, if we need to put it a, a percentage of it, I would say that it probably accelerated our time to market around 80%. It enables us to um, budget elsewhere in the business um, to, to develop those areas faster because we don't need the resources um, that you would, you would need with conventional CAD software. From the moment we discussed and started open communications with CADTEC, it was very clear that you know, CADTEC were the ones for us to support us. Um, we, in this early stage, especially when we're dealing with SOLIDWORKS as, as its initial stage with staff training, um, knowledge for me, product training is a huge thing. You know, SOLIDWORKS has such an enormous amount of capability and, it's, it, and for any, any kind of any, any business that is buying the software, training for me again is, is a massive priority. SOLIDWORKS for me is great and it's great from a management point of view as well because when we, when we are sat in a technical meeting and discuss parts that we find are causing us issues, parts that need improvement and parts of the, the product that works well, but we can do it in a visual means. We're not looking at a, a 2D drawing that you cannot visualise. We are, we are looking at how these components fit not only with the other components that we, we, we may make with the product, but also how they fit in their environments that they're going to be working on.